Right now, the search is on for a trailer worth thousands of dollars, but worth much more to the community of Vega. Pro News 7's Natalie Granda joins us now with more on that story. Natalie? Larry, I spoke to members of the community who say this is, quote, a tragedy for the community, not just because of the theft, but because of the loss of what they say is a symbol of hard work for the city of Vega. The trailer was built by a couple of local students who say they spent months on this project and hate to see it gone. It started as a school project for Vega residents Matt Montgomery and his friend Gerardo. We put tons of work and tons of time into it. We were at it every day. Montgomery's custom-made welding trailer became an asset to the community and even as a way to make a couple of bucks. We use it a lot, kind of make our money here and there. But come Monday morning, it was gone. It's very valuable. I mean, me and my buddy put lots of time, lots of hours into it, and we're never going to get to have that trailer again. The trailer was last used by an AgriLife Extension agent, Austin Boyles, who called the family and asked to use the trailer to work on some repairs at the 4-H animal feeding facility for upcoming animal shows. I started those repairs and couldn't finish them. Uh, and then when we returned from uh, our state meeting, uh, it, it, we found that out that it, was, uh, it had been missing. Boyle said he left the trailer parked by the facility less than a mile away from businesses, homes, and the main road. City Marshal Mike Carver says the trailer went missing Wednesday evening and was reported by Montgomery's father. Boyle says he also got word the trailer was spotted more than 50 miles away. It was spotted in Friona uh, Monday morning uh, at a local gas station. And Oldham County Judge Don Alred says he feels, quote, concerned and terrible about this incident and is even thinking of giving people an incentive to keep an eye out. We at this time are um, anticipating and considering putting a um, reward together to, uh, for the information for the return or the uh, arrest of those involved. Marshall says the Oldham County Sheriff's Department is currently handling the case. The trailer is bright blue and has the names of both boys on the trailer. And the trailer is estimated at $10,000. Anyone that has any information on the trailer is encouraged to call the Oldham County Sheriff's Department. Natalie Granda, Pro News 7.